Welcome back to the channel, everybody. And if you're new here, hello, thanks for watching. If you like what you see, please like, comment, subscribe, do all those good things. This is Motor Mike Media, and as always, I'm Motor Mike, and today we're talking about the Mercedes AMG EQS 53. And this is the high performance variant of the EQS. And the EQS is a large electric sed sedan from Mercedes, basically the same size as the S Class. Now, if you want something with full of tech, full of performance, this is the way to go, especially for an EV. Now let's talk about the styling. The front end, it's uh, different if you will. You can see everything's kind of jelly bean shaped. Now that's for aerodynamics. This has a very low coefficient of drag. I do really like the headlights, the grill area. It's cool looking, it's interesting. It's not a real grill of course, but it is a little bit more sporty compared to the base model of this vehicle. Now the side profile. Now here's where you can kind of see that jelly bean like shape I was telling you because it is aerodynamic and sometimes aerodynamics isn't quite beautiful, at least not in my opinion. Now beauty is in the eyes of the beholder. You guys can let me know if you guys like it. I will say it's great looking uh, body lines on it. The silhouette's not my favorite, but going to the rear end, I do really like that tail light in the back. The single uh, beam all the way across. It's a cool LED signature. Now the interior. The interior is awesome in my opinion, no matter what EQS you get. Uh, everything's super premium. This is supposed to be like an electric S-Class, if you will. So you have leathers, nice stitching, nice piping. Here on the AMG one, you have premium leather that's perforated, nice red stitching. You also have suede, Alcatara, all these awesome sporty features and lots of carbon fiber. Now the thing here is the hyper screen, what Mercedes calls this big screen layout. Big digital gauge cluster, a giant middle uh, touch screen, and then over on the passenger side, they have a screen in front of them. It's all under one big piece of glass. It looks very premium. It's awesome to look at, and supposedly, from what people are saying, it's the one of the best systems in the business. High resolution. Now, yes, your features have to go through there. There's very few hard touch buttons, which is unfortunate. I like hard touch buttons, but it does look premium. I worry about the future, though, when these vehicles get old. How much will it cost to fix this? But as of right now, it does look very futuristic and it's very cool looking. Overall, this vehicle is supposed to be the high performance variant. So how much power does it have? Well, if we put it in race mode, you hit the little race button, 751 horsepower and about 742 pound-feet of torque. Lots and lots of power. Now it is AMG, so they changed a lot of suspension components, bigger brakes, uh, it has rear wheel steer steering as well, so you can make those sharp turns. Now, it might not look like other Mercedes, but it's supposed to be a future of their EVs to come. It does look sharp. It is very futuristic in design with crazy power. It's about 107.8 kilowatt hour battery pack in here. That zero to 60 time is 3.4 seconds. So it is performance oriented. It is future full of tech, full of luxury. So we'll have to see it. Will other Mercedes copy this jelly bean like shape? Or will they kind of have a mix of both, having combustion engines and EVs for a while, and when everything is EVs or hybrids, have a little bit of the boxier styling as well as this styling. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. What are things you like and don't like about this vehicle? Are you a fan of the jelly bean shape? Are there bits and pieces that you love and parts you don't? Please let me know in the comments down below. And if you haven't already and you want to, please check out my channel. I keep trying to give you guys more and more content. I talk cars, trucks, crossovers, and SUVs, combustion engines, and EVs just like this. A little of everything, but please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That way you guys can stay up to date with the latest and greatest for my channel. And as always, I truly, truly appreciate you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.